Hello children, how are you all? I hope you are all safe at home. So uh, today we are going to discuss some more problems based on the cylinder, right? So yesterday we discussed uh, how to find CSA and as well as TSA of different types of cylinders, okay? And it is related to our day-to-day -day life situations. Now let us discuss some more questions from the same 13 point two exercise. Start from question number nine, okay? Exercise 13.2, question number 9. So here, I am going to read the question. You just listen here. Find, a, in that there are two sub-questions are there. First question is, a, the lateral or curved surface area of a closed cylindrical petrol storage tank that is 4.2 meters in diameter and 4.5 meter height. So here they are asking, find a, Lateral or curved surface area. CSA of cylinder. Uh, the given dimensions are the diameter of base is 4.2 meters and the height is equal to 4.5 meters. Now see this here first of all. Given that, given that uh, the diameter, the diameter of the diameter of petrol tank. Okay. Uh, or petrol storage tank, okay? Diameter of tank is equal to uh, diameter is nothing but uh, 2 R, okay? 2 R is equal to that is 4.2 uh, meters. So then radius small r is equal to that is 4.2 divided by 2. When we cancellation, we have 2 ones are 2.1, that is 2.1 meters. Clear? Now the given height also. Height of the tank which is equal to 4.5 meters. Now they are asking curved surface area of uh, closed storage, closed, closed uh, petrol storage tank. Now here uh, CSA of tank, CSA of tank is equal to that is 2 pi r h. Now subtract the values which is implies uh, 2 into 22 by 7 into R is 2.1 and H equal to 4.5 So 2.1 is nothing but uh, this is a 0 0.3 Okay, now which is implies 2, 22 is 44 44 into 3 by 10 into 45 by 10 here Now multiply 44 into 3 into 45 So you will get, uh, I am going to multiply here 44 into 3 which is nothing but 3 4 are 12, 2 here 1 carry over 12 plus 130, 132, which is into 45. Okay, 132 into 45 also we need to find out. 5 2 are 10, 5 3 are 15 plus 1 is 6, that is 16, 1 carry over. 5 1 are 5 plus 1 is 6 here. Now into 4 2 are 8, 4 3 are 12, 1 carry over. 4 1 are 4 plus 1 is 5. So, which is implies 0, 14, 1 carry over, 8 plus 1, 9, 5, 5, 9, 4, 0. So, which is implies 5, 9, 4, 0 divided by 100, which is nothing but 59.4 centimeter, sorry, meter square. They given in terms of meter, no? Right. You need to write the units compulsory. So, therefore, therefore here, CSA of tank, CSA of tank is equal to that is a 59.4 meter square. Okay, this is the therefore statement. What is the answer? 59.4 meter square. This is the first one. But here, second question is uh, how much steel was actually used to make a petrol tank? They used uh, that is a uh, steel. Okay, steel they used. So in that. 1 by 12th part of steel actually used was wasted in uh, making the tank. When making the tank, 1 by 12th part of the steel was wasted. So to make a closed tank, we require total surface area. Okay. Now we need to find out TSA. Okay. What is TSA of cylinder here? What is the formula TSA of cylinder? What is the TSA of cylinder? Yes, 2 pi r into r plus h. I think it, this is clear for you. Okay, can I erase this part? Right. So now I am going to erase this part only. Clear? 
Now we are going to find out uh, TSA. Okay. Now TSA of cylinder. What is the TSA of cylinder? Yes. The formula is 2 pi r into r plus h. Now TSA of cylinder or tank. You can take tank. Okay. Here TSA of tank is equal to TSA of tank is equal to that is 2 pi r into r plus h. Now which is implies uh, 2 into 22 by 7 into r is 2.1 into 2.1 plus 4.5. Now which is implies uh, 7 1s are 7 0.3. Now 2 22 is 44. 44 into 0 0.3 uh, into by adding these two that is 6.6. Now which is implies again 44 into 3 by 10 into 66 by 10 here. Now multiply 44 into 3 is 132 already we know that. 132 into 66 when we multiply 132 into 66. 6 2 is 12. 1 carry over. 6 3 is 18 plus 1 is 19. 19 1 carry over. 6 1 is 6 plus 1 7. Into again 792. So 2 11 uh, 9 17 8. That is 8 7 1 2 which is implies sir. 8712 by 100 which is equal to what is the answer here 87.12 meter square this is so therefore here therefore TSA of tank is equal to TSA of tank equal to 87 point 87 point 12 meter square so this is a TSA of tank okay petrol tank you observe outside of the outside okay on the roads Petrol tank will become totally cylindrical shape. So for that, CSA also we find out, TSA also we find out. Clear? Now, second question we are going to discuss. Uh, please copy this. Now, children. In that second part, what is that here? How much steel uh, was actually used if 1 by 12th part of 1 by 12th part of steel actually used was wasted in making a cylindrical tank. So here you just think that 1 by 12th part means totally 12 parts are there. Out of 12 parts, 1 by 12 part will become wasted. How much is remaining here? Out of total one tank, so to make one tank from this total one, you can subtract one by twelve part. What is the left over here? Eleven by twelve. So this is the steel they used to make a, a cylindrical petrol tank. Clear, my dears? So uh, to make a petrol close uh, petrol tank, the uh, uh, steel. How much steel you used to? To make a petrol tank is 11 by 12. Okay. So totally one petrol tank from the total one, from the total one, you just subtract one by 12th part. That is wasted part we need to subtract from the total. Total is nothing but one only. Okay. From that one, you can subtract one by 12th part. This is wasted. This part is nothing but wasted. Okay. When you making the petrol tank, this part is wasted. That wasted we need to subtract. The remaining part is nothing but 11 by 12. Okay. This, this much steel they used means 11 by 12th part of the total surface area. Okay. Right. So this 11 by 12th part uh, steel they used to make the petrol tank. Clear. So we don't know how much steel is used here. Clear. So let us take that x meter square steel is used for to make a petrol tank. Okay. Now let us discuss. You can understand in a simple way still. Okay. Now second part, let, let the total area of, let the total area of metal sheet or steel, okay, uh, we can take steel, area of steel, okay, uh, let the total area of steel is equal to, which is equal to x, uh, let us say capital X, okay, x meter square. Or you can take any other variable, right? 
from this x meter square still they used so totally they used x meter square when it, when they making the petrol tank 1 by 2 th part of the steel is wasted so that 1 by 2 th part of x we are going to subtract from the x so now wasted steel is equal to wasted part steel is equal to which is 1 by 2 th part clear of x meter square clear so now 1 by 2 th part of x is equal to which is nothing but what is the 1 by 2 th part of x that is x by 12 okay which is equal to x by 12 part is wasted then how much is steel used for making a trank right so now uh, actual steel used actual uh, here right actually used actually used steel is equal to to make a petrol tank which is nothing but the total total here I am going to write capital X sorry capital X right capital X now total is X here total is X meter square from that wasted part we are going to subtract X minus X by 12 now which is implies 12X minus X by 12 which is implies 11 by 12 of x steel they used 11 by x 12 meter square okay this much steel they used so now already we know that what right children so tsc of tank we got here 87.12 meter square okay so now these two areas will be equal because the total actually used steel is nothing but 11 by 12 x meter square we got so this much steel they used to make a cylindrical tank so total cylinder closed cylinder tank is nothing but tsc of this cylinder tank so now these two areas will be coming which is implies 11 by 12 of x is equal to which is equal to 87.12 meter square now from this we can find find out x value okay now uh, see this here which is implies 11 by 12 of x is equal to 87.12 Transpose this 11 by 12 to right hand side, you will get it is 12 by 11. Right? So x is equal to 87.12 into 12 by 11. Now by cancellation, uh, x is equal to 8712 by 100 into 12 by 11. By cancellation, 11 ones are 11 sevens are right 77. 10 101, 11 9s are 99, so 2 11 2s are clear, 792 into 12, we are going to find out here, 792 into 12, which is nothing but 12, 4, uh, 8, 14 plus 1, 15, 792, now 4, 8, 10, 15, 9, 9504, so x is equal to 9504 divided by 100 which is equal to 95.04 meter square of steel is used to make a cylindrical uh, petrol tank so now i'm going to write the therefore statement here okay so you can understand in a better way right therefore therefore here the therefore 95.04 meter square of steel used of steel used to make a to make a, a closed cylindrical cylindrical petrol tank petrol tank clear my dears right clear Please copy this. Right, children. I hope you understood that previous question. Clear? So now coming to the let us discuss one more question. Question number 10. It's a lengthy problem, a simple problem, but question is very lengthy. Very easy. 
Okay, just try to understand that. Uh, you see the frame of a lamp shade, the page number uh, 217, uh, figure 13.12. See this, I draw the, uh, I did on the board also. Now, uh, you see the frame of a lamp shade. It is to be covered with a decorative cloth. Okay, that lamp lamp shade is decorated with a cover cloth. The frame has a base diameter of 20 cm and a height of 30 cm. A margin of 2.5 cm is to be given for folding it cover the top and bottom of the frame. Here 2.5 of margin is given extra part for the lamp shade for top and bottom. Right? Find how much cloth is required for covering the lamp shade. Total lamp shade we are going to cover with a cloth. So now see this here. Here we need to think that the given diameter and height of the lamp shade and nevertheless they given that 2.5 of margin is extra that is a 2.5 of centimeter is to be given for folding it cover the top and bottom of the frame to cover okay here they given little bit extra part so now I am going to try, draw that is extra part that is 2.5 centimeter this is extra part okay this is this part is extra 2.5 centimeter top and bottom top and bottom top and bottom they given that is a extra part okay so this part is extra that is 2.5 centimeter here also and from here to here it will become 30 centimeter and the diameter is a diameter is how much here 20 centimeter this is 20 centimeter so now now the what is the actual height of the they given the actual height of the lampshade is 30 centimeter but they given margin to for folding top and bottom is 2.5 2.5 clear so this part is 2.5 okay this part is 2.5 so now by adding these 2.5 these 2.5 to the 30 you will get the total height of the lamp shade with margin so okay now see this here given that given that diameter Diameter of lamp shade, diameter of lamp shade, which is equal to that is 2R, which is equal to 30, sorry, 20 centimeter. Now, then R is equal to 10 centimeter. Then, height of the lamp, height of the lamp shade, which is equal to, which is equal to, right? Uh, with margin, okay. With margin, with margin, you can understand here yeah? better. With margin, which is equal to lamp shade height plus margin plus margin, which is equal to 30 centimeters plus 2.5 in the top, the less 2.5 in the bottom. Okay, now which is, is equal to, which is implies 30 plus 2.5 plus 2.5 is 5, which is implies 35 centimeters. Now, we got uh, the total height of the lamp shade is 35 centimeter and diameter is nothing but 20 centimeter. From that, it is equal to 10 centimeter. Now, they are asking that, find how much cloth is required for covering the lamp shade. To cover this total lamp shade, what is the cover? So, now, what is the cloth is required? So, we can uh, cover with only uh, curved surface area, not top and bottom. If you cover top and bottom, we cannot see anything. So, just cover cloth, lampshade, that is a cloth, uh, only curved surface area. So, now which is implies uh, CAC of, CAC of lampshade, which is equal to, what is the formula here? S2 pi R H. Now, which is implies uh, 2 into 22 by 7 into, what is R here? R equal to 10, nevertheless uh, height equal to 35. Okay, now by cancellation 7 1s are 7 5s are right, 5 2s are 10, 10 100. So 22 into 100, uh, which is nothing but 2200 uh, 
that is centimeter square. So therefore here, therefore how much class is required? Right. Therefore, uh, the total class is required. Total class. Total class is required. Is required for what? Uh, covered. Required for. For uh, covering of. For covering of lamp shade. Okay, which is nothing but lamp shade. Lamp shade, which is equal to two hundred, sir, two thousand two hundred, two thousand two hundred centimeter square. Clear? So, can find out only. So, try to understand the question here. They given margin top and bottom is two point five centimeter in the top and the last two point five centimeter in the bottom also. This margin also we should include to the lamp shade to cover with cloth. Clear, my dears. So total is how much here? Two thousand two hundred centimeter square. Centimeter square cloth is required to cover the lamp shade. Clear? I hope you understood that. Please copy this. Uh, right, children. Let us discuss question number eleven. Right. So now uh, here it is a little bit. Uh, it's a, it is applicable to you only. Okay. Very interesting question. The students of a Vidyalaya were asked to participate in a competition for making and decorating pen holders in the shape of a cylinder with a base using cardboard. Each pen holder was to be of radius three centimeter, height is ten point five centimeter. The vidyalaya was to supply the competitors with cardboard. If there were thirty five competitors, how much cardboard was required to be bought for the competition? Now, see this year in this vidyalaya, there is a competition is going on. In that competition, the people want to make a Pen holders, which is in the form of a, a cylindrical shape, with, uh, which has a base. Nothing but pen caps. See this here. This is a marker cap. See, uh, this is a pen holder. Clear? This is a pen holder. In this, uh, base should be closed. It is looking like a cylinder shape, and uh, this is a pen holder with cardboard. They want to make. So they they need to keep like this. Simple. Clear? This is a pen holder. Clear? Uh, right. So here they given the radius of the base equal to three centimeter and the height is ten point five centimeter. So totally there are thirty five competitors. Competitors are there. How much cardboard is required to uh, to be bought for the competition? So now here we are going to find out for first of all for one person. Then we can multiply with thirty five. We will get the total answer. So here. The students of Vidyalaya were making a decorating pen holders in the shape of a cylinder with a base using cardboard. Now here, each pen holder was to be radius of. Now given that, given that the radius of the radius of pen holder pen holder is equal to three centimeters and the height. Of, Height is equal to height of pen holder. Height of pen holder is equal to ten point five centimeter. Clear? Now, see this one. See, looking look, look like this uh, cap. It is a CSA and plus base area. It should be closed also. You want? They want to close this base also. Clear? So what we are going to find out here? Carbon surface area of cylinder plus base area plus Base area. The question they given: decorating pen holders in the shape of a cylinder with a base. Okay. Now, uh, CSA or you can take not CSA here. Uh, we are going to find out uh, area is required. Right. Area of cardboard is required for area of cardboard. 
is required for is required for one person or one pen holder or oh, sorry one pen holder which is equal to, which is equal to, right uh, that is a csa of cylinder or csa of pen holder okay plus base area plus base area which is nothing but 2 pi r h plus base is in the form of circle area of circle is nothing but pi r square we know the value of r value and h radius and the height they given substitute those two values in this formula we will get the uh, area of cardboard is required for one pen holder we will get that that is one for one person okay now 2 into 22 by 7 into r is 3 centimeter into h is equal to that is 10.5 that is 10.5 plus pi r square that is 22 by 7 into r square is 3 into 3 so now in between these sir, which are the common values 22 by 7 into 3 22 by 7 into 3 i am going to take common you can in, uh, calculate very easily by taking the common here 2 is a 2 into 10.5 is a left over 2 into 10.5 plus 3 okay now this is a 66 by 7 into uh, 2 into 10.5 is nothing but 21 okay 21 plus 3 so which is in price 66 uh, by 7 into 24 so 24 is not cancelling 7 table so you can multiply these two what is the value here 66 into 24 now 4 6 are 24 4 6 are 24 plus 2 26 into now you should multiply with 2 2 6 are 12 2 6 are 12 plus 1 13 ok 4 8 5 1 here 15 84 uh, which is equal to 15 84 by 7 that is a centimeter square this is for one pen holder to make one pen holder for one person this much cardboard is required okay now there are how many competitors are there totally 35 competitors are there okay please copy this right children now there are how many competitors, competitors are there Totally 35 competitors are there. So we are going to find out for 35 competitors. Now we got a, so therefore here uh, the cardboard is required or required cardboard is required cardboard required required cardboard required cardboard for one competitor one competitor totally how many are there here totally 35 competitors are there okay one competitor one competitor one competitor which is equal to uh, 1584 by 7 centimeter square so therefore here total totally total 35 competitors are there total competitors are there total 35 competitors are there so therefore here therefore total area of cardboard total area of cardboard is required area of total area of cardboard is required is required for is required for required for 35 competitors 35 competitors which is equal to 35 into 1584 by 7 cm square ok so now we just uh, now we can simplify with 35 into 1584 by 7 this part we are going to erase clear so now here now 7 ones are 7 fives are clear which is implies 5 into 1584 centimeter square now multiply 1584 into 5 
you will get a 5 fours are 20 2 carry over 5 eights are 40 40 plus 2 is 42 ok 5 fives are 25 plus 4 is 29 2 carry over 5 and the 5 plus 1 7 so totally 7920 cm square is required for cardboard for total for 35 composition so therefore here therefore total area of cardboard is equal to right total uh, right now so total area of cardboard is equal to total area of cardboard is required is required for is required for for making making pen holder 35 pen holders clear for making 35 pen holder pen holders is equal to how much it is 7920 centimeter square 7920 centimeter square uh, cardboard is required for making 35 pen holders clear my dears i hope you understood that please copy this right children i hope you understood that today's class whatever we discuss the problem sir so here is today's homework uh, page number 217 exercise 13.2 question number 7 and question number 8 clear my dears uh, thank you. Have a nice day.